broke y'all Back to finally meet y'all phone Yeah, I shook her father head firmly Gave my peeps a hug gently Gently, gently Her father had the word for the week Candace Wilson speaking. It's Latrice Wilson, 24. Address Hello? 8673 Edmonton Road, Shreveport, Louisiana, 71106. Social Security Who number 419-112964. Primary bank account with Chase. How did Company you get... account Falcon Mercenary. Mother's name Rachel. Father's name Gregory. No siblings. Boyfriend named Vine. Closest friend Jasmine, three tattoos and four piercings. Do I have your attention? Do I have your attention? Yes. You will be given an envelope to deliver. The package is very. What kind of package? Failure to deliver will result in your name being discredited as well as financial ruin. says level six protection. If anybody around her for more than a minute, you gonna start surveillance. James, you know she got some. Okay. Where is Latrell? Ah, oh, it's in 71106. And they're like she's about to leave for work. Tracy, who we got over there? Um, Kyle Dre. That's him and Vicky's on anyway. They should be up. Cool. Bonjour. Uh, où est la station de l'essence? Hmm? Excusez-moi. Tu parles français? Je parle un peu. Ah, bien, bien. Uh, restez calme. Stay. Thirty seconds. Hey y'all, search the house. Okay. Oh. Yeah, I'm okay. I just had a long day. I know the feeling. What's your name? <laughs> I'm flattered. You seem like a nice guy, but... Nice nah, guy. nah, nah. I'm not trying to get your number or anything. What's your name? You already know my name. 
What's this? Don't open it. You'll regret it. Nice to meet you, Candace. Hey. Hey. Is everything alright? Yeah, I'm doing fine. I'm okay. There's a pig sty here. It looked like somebody broke in. Oh. No, I was looking for something. I was in a rush. Are you sure? You're not lying to me, are you? Because you don't have to go back to work. And I can just stay here. No, you don't have to stay. I'm okay. You sure? Honestly, you don't have to stay. But I, right. well, I'll talk to you later. You bet I had my cup, Jeff. Ain't nobody had your cup, Renee. Hey, girl. Yeah. girl. I thought you had a presentation today. Oh, no, that's tomorrow. Oh, okay. Well, I saw your mom and dad on vacation. Oh, mm -hmm. they said something about they wanted. Oh, yeah, I didn't even know. I'm hungry. Can't get out the way. Dex. What's up? I need to ask you something. I'm married, and no, you cannot have my number, Candace. Uh, no, I need you to finalize my papers. I have to leave now. Today? Yes, right now. Let me see how much I like you. Really? That's cool. But. You gotta finalize my stuff for Friday so I can get out of here. Okay, okay, you got it. And oh I want a Starbucks gift card. Really? Yes, so I can get me one of them Frappuccinos that I like. Is that it? And I'm just playing. I got you. How you gonna leave? Your car ain't even outside. Jeffrey, how long have you been right here? Um, a couple of hours, but I ain't seen nothing. You must have seen something. I saw you pull in here and left your top down. I was late. I ain't got nothing to do with you and your boyfriend. But... Maybe it was just, you know, somebody trying to teach you a lesson on how to be more careful when you're delivering something. Delivering? What are you talking about? Yeah, I don't know. I'm just talking. Just a temporary IT worker. Girl, what we eating today? Hey, Jasmine, I need you to take me somewhere. Girl, we got a lot of work to do today. 
Don't worry about it. I will take care of it. Well, since she put it like that, it ain't nothing but a word. Well, let me grab my purse, okay? Ain't that Renee Cup? Oh uh, yeah, she don't need it though. All that money she gave her from Claire. Yeah, you right. Candace caught back at house, by the way. You think she gonna make it? Um, I don't know. I had to save her from some hackers this morning. Intercepted a fake feed, but we'll find out if she can get past Cuchillo. Man, Claire wrong for you. Let's get so man. I know, right? <laughs> So, you sure you're gonna be okay? Yeah, girl, I'm fine. Just drop me off right here, and I'll just talk to you later. into my phone. I've been carrying around this heavy purse all day. Well, I got a mission saying I have something for you. Meet me downtown. Your name is Candace, right? Yeah. Are you Chilo? Chio. Chio. Candace is scheduled for delivering envelopes to me. But if you can get it to me, I have $20,000 for you. Now, she's going to try and act like she don't know what you're talking about. But with your history, I'm sure you can persuade her. And I'll see one of you soon. Candice, can I call you Can Can? I need the envelope. Today. You're not gonna get far in those shoes, Boo Boo Kitty. Wait, what if I gave you $20,000? Cash? Even better. Uh, I can wire it to you in four checks, and I can have it look like you would do temp work for me. I guess you are as good as they say you are. Headquarters. Stand by. I'm gonna schedule a pickup and delivery. 1738 Delta to 628 Greenleaf. To my parents' house? Confirm. Alpha X-ray Echo. Vehicle is in route. Of course. Don't worry. Vacation's on us. So the package has arrived. Nice house your parents have here, Candace. So where's the envelope? Why me? Why not you? It's simple. We knew you could do the job. You see, Candace, God gives his strongest warriors the toughest challenges. So consider yourself honored. Candace, I want you to work for me. 
work for you? Yeah. Just consider today an evaluation. You're a sales rep, right? Well, just look at it as you're transferring jobs for more money. So what exactly does your business do? You can say we're in the business of protection. People pay us to keep their secrets. Some secrets not so big. Some secrets can start wars. I'll be the one pitching while millionaires need to pay for our business. Millionaires, that's cute. So do we have a deal? Yes. Well, we'll be in contact with more information. Oh, and by the way, sorry about your boyfriend. His girlfriend left him after someone sent pictures of him with another woman. Thanks. So, what was in the envelope anyway? And I hope your new co-workers didn't startle you too much. It was just blank sheets of paper. This whole time I thought it was something important. The envelope had blank sheets of paper, but that wasn't the package we were looking for. What was the package? The package was you.